Hey guys, um, just thought this might be a cool model to show you. I used to use this in classes in a couple of years ago. I tried to do it last year. Um, only problem is it's Java based and so the web based version doesn't work in literally any browser anymore. So um, just going to show you here if you want to take a look at it. Kind of a cool little thing. Um, it's supposed to be a computer simulation of how energy flows through the earth, right? So I'm going to click run right here. Oh, you don't see it. I think I cut off that part of the recording. I'm going to click run. And, you know, we just see some kind of cool stuff happening. So think about this movement. I'm going to stop it real quick. So, you know, this interior part, it was like warmer. So they used white as warmth, right? This blue part is it was cooler, right? So um, what we saw is this movement of the warmer material, right? moving up and we see this cooler material moving up. I'm going to hit reset real quick so watch that happen again. Okay, so all this cool material is sinking back down, all this warm material is moving up. Now, this cool material sitting down here, see what happens? The warm material sitting up here, let's see what happens there also. Okay, let's keep running. It's changing color. So what does it mean when it's changing color? It's cooling and then you can see it kind of sinking back down and the core is releasing out more, right? So, just let it keep going. I see the color of the core changing. It's less bright than it used to be. Think about what that means. Just think about, look at the motion of all these, all right? Like, look at this swirl coming down. Look at this dark blue area. It's sinking back down toward the core, right? This right here, sinking back down towards the core. This right there, the light area floating up towards the surface. All right, so this is like a cool way of seeing convection happening in Earth, just a computer simulation. Now, if we let this thing keep running for a while, you can see what's going to happen, right? So eventually, the core, over probably billions of years, all right, it's going to release all this energy. Eventually, Right, kind of sad stuff is going to happen. Um, while we wait, I'm going to go ahead and open up this. And oh, see, this is the only selection that is going to capture. Boo. All right, never mind. I'll show you guys that later, I guess. Mm, okay. All right, so what do you guys think is eventually going to happen? All right, how's this color changing? It's getting darker and darker and darker. So it's getting cooler and cooler and cooler. So just look and see how fast is this convection occurring. It seems like it's slowing down a lot. It seems like that cool blue area is kind of traveling a lot faster than the than the lightened areas. There's no more yellow. There's no more orange. Okay. So it's just this idea that shows you that, you know, convection only occurs when we have uneven heating within a substance. So the heat source usually near the bottom center of the earth in this case, when there's no more uneven heating, eventually everything's just going to cool. Okay, um, kind of complicated. If you guys want, I'll go ahead and put a link um, for where you can download this stuff, I guess. A uh, little bit tricky, um, but if you want to you play with it, I'll give you that link. Okay, all right, that's all I want to do with this video. Okay, bye.